All right, hey guys, I am here this morning with Mr. Dilly. So we're gonna go through just some of the regular warm-ups that we do at, that at Marcus. And I know maybe some of the other schools are gonna use this too, so it's awesome, glad you can join us. Um, so when we start off our warm-ups, we always talk about our posture first. Make sure your feet are shoulder width apart, knees unlocked, rib cage open. So I use that terminology, collapsed is when you're hunched forward. This is an open rib cage. Shoulders are down and relaxed, hands at your sides. Make sure your chin is parallel to the ground, and then you are ready to sink. So let's do a couple breathing things. If you would please take a nice, deep, open, silent, yawn breath in. We'll breathe in for four beats, and then hiss out for 12. One, two, silent breath in. Two, four, six, eight, ten, and twelve. This time we'll do two beats in and out for 16. One, two, silent breath in. Okay, this time we'll do a half beat breath in. We practice this one because a lot of times in our music we don't have a long time to breathe and we still want it to be quiet. So for a half a breath, I'll count to four and we're gonna breathe on the end of four. One and two and three and four, like that. So we'll go in for half a beat and then out for 20 on a pulse, eighth note pulse. One, two and three and four. Four, three, two, one, and stop. All right, repeat after me. exercises. So this is going to be what we'll do. So me so and we'll, we'll go down from there. One, two, three. switching to ah. This one will go see ya ha ha see ya see ya ha ha go to ready see ya ha ha Double check that you 
are still using good posture, make sure you're taking nice, um, deep and silent breaths before you start each exercise. Just something to keep track of the whole time we're doing warm ups. So this next one is to focus on our vowels. We wanna make sure we have tall, pure Latin vowels for this. So the words are me, we, fa, lo, you. Me, we, fa, lo, you. So Latin vowels are e, e, a, o, u. So um, this is what it sounds like. So the hand motions are representative of your mouth shape. So me has a nice tall roof of the mouth. Me, we, I want vertical space as opposed to this way. We, and then fa, nice and open. O, fa, lo, and then fu, for you. Let's do it one more time. Um, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100 are our words. I want lots of T's, lots of consonants, except the R, back away from the R. So we're just going to do 30 instead of 30. All right. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60. for high school choir. A few of these are, are scales that you need to be able to sing from Mr. Allen. So just keep that in mind. And if not, singing solfege and singing our scales is a great way to warm up our voices and work on, on our ear training, our, our aural scales. So we'll do, um, what's that? That's C. Let's do D major. Starting on low do. Do. syllables as well. So as you're doing your solfege, sometimes when I'm lazy, I just sing do, re, mi. But um, if we're really being precise and using great choral sound, we want it to be do, re, mi, same as we would with our Latin vowels. So let's try another scale. Let's do, um, let's do F major. Okay, All right, higher one. So again, using your hand signs, practicing great vowels on your solfege. Do, re, mi. Just that one more time. 
That's good. I think uh, for the ones who don't know the chromatics, you go through each one just so, because they've got time to learn it. So maybe oh, sure. Okay, so here's the syllables. chromatic ones by themselves. So do, re, mi, fa, sol, la, ti, do is still in there, but wherever there's like a black key on the piano is where we're gonna add an extra solfege. They're different on the way up than they are on the way down. So we do sharps on the way up and flats on the way down. So the order is do, d, re, re, mi, fa, si, so, si, La, Li, T, Do. And then down we have Do, T, Te, La, Le, So, Se, Fa, Mi, Me, Re, Ra, Do. All right, thanks guys. Happy practicing.